Okay, so I'm going to start with my wrap up here, guys. And I'm going to start it off with the, the Dixie. So earlier in the week, I was talking about a move in the dollar index up towards 96, 96.20. That has almost manifested. So I'm looking for some type of reversal day, either tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, to trade the dollar back down to the downside, looking at individual instruments. I won't get too bearish on the euro here, although I think the pound is still holding up better and may outperform. I'd like to see the euro get back above this line here. I'd like to see it start trading above 112. That would be the first hint that we're getting a turn, but the pound definitely is holding up much better. I have some confluence coming in around three and a half for a potential buy in the cable. Here's your daily, pretty negative day. So I'm sure the pound bears are gonna come out of the closet here, but I'm thinking 53 is gonna be a range, 52.60. Uh, Euro pound, been right about that one for a while. I'm still looking for much lower levels, but I figure after we clear out the 72 level, We'll get some type of bounce. But I've been talking about a move in the euro pound down to beneath 71, <clears throat> looking more like 70 and a half for a potential right shoulder. And Canada, we called this reflex rally. I'd be looking for shorts in the Canada in the next couple of days. Maybe it's going to be up above 132, which is 61.8. And I want to thank everyone for their contributions today.